Guess what? We're back at it with another chocolate bar. Isn't that nice? In the kitchen? It's kind of cold outside, kind of raining. Anyway, this is a Hazel Hill chocolate bar, again, at a Topeka, Kansas. This actually won, uh, I guess, the uh, Chocolate Awards, uh, International Chocolate Awards, America's 2019. Pow! Um, it is a, uh, if I even know how to pronounce this, Oka, uh, Oko, Karibi, Kareba, Karebe, I don't know, Dominican Republic, um, what is it, 70% cacao, it's 70% dark, anyway, enough, let's just open the dadgam bar, um, sunflowers, those are nice, anyway, you know, just open it up, see what it's about. Isn't that just good looking? Just a good looking sexy bar. I mean, in life, if you can look at your food and call it sexy, you're doing all right. Ooh, the H's. Oh my God. Mmm, hmm. Okay. <sighs> Let me turn on my tongue. Hmm. I mean, it's really good. It's really good. Hand. Crafted by God. And, um, yeah. Hey, little chocolate out of the Topeka, uh, Kansas. Um, you know. If you're a typically not a fan of just just dark chocolate in general, this stuff has flavor. Yeah, it's dark. Oh my. What? It's good. Did you know? You taste through your nose. Not through your nose, but breathing. <sighs> mm. Anyway, that's all I got. It's a dead game good bar. Really good. I mean, I'm no connoisseur or man of knowledge, but um, it's just good. That's all I got. So all I'm gonna say, yes, sir, yes, indeed. Uh, Yippee Kaye! You have a good day, and I'm gonna uh, have a daggum good day. Yes, sir.